The Voice Over LT initiative by the GSMA was launched at World Congress in 2010 and at 2011 World Congress uh, we were able to demonstrate the first Voice Over LT handset demonstration. We did that in conjunction with Verizon Wireless who uh, provided the Spectrum, uh, with Alcatel Lucent who provided the Core Network and uh, the RAN and with LG who provided the handsets. So we had a total of 12 handsets, four on our stand, four on LG stand, four on Verizon Wireless's stand, making voice calls using um, a wideband AMR codec, so high definition voice, uh, and also supporting um, video conferencing as well and video calling. So the really key thing I think that the demonstration um, showed the, the, so as, as an industry was that the latency on LTE is really low, which is important for voice quality. Particularly with regard to the video, the voice and video synchronization that we demonstrated there had lip sync, um, it had latency which you could detect to be well, well under a second, more in the region of maybe 100, about 100 to 150 milliseconds. And these are things which previously have stopped video telephony taking off. So video telephony latency where the voice arrives and the video hasn't quite caught up um, is a real disruptive influence to um, the perception of the service for the end user. If you take that out of the way, then suddenly video telephony becomes a really viable service and also indicates that the voice quality is going to be excellent as well. What we see is coming next is the beginnings of a, a genuine ecosystem around voice over LTE. So with a handset from LG and there was also a handset which uh, was being demonstrated by Samsung uh, with Ericsson Core Network on Ericsson stand in Hall 6, suggests that not only have we got one instance of a demonstration, but we're going to see uh, a growing number of handsets and Core Network supporting this work. And the next big uh, tick in the box that we're going to demonstrate, we have an interoperability event in September, which we're working on with a group called the Multi-Service Forum. We have an open invite to all vendors to come and participate in that work, um, which is on the Multi-Service Forum's webpage. And at that point, we expect to see genuine infrastructure, genuine ecosystem, a number of handsets being tested and demonstrated at that event, plus a, a whole range of core networks from a whole bunch of different vendors.